Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I'm here to do a reading for Leo. This is for Leo, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus, and this is for the month of August. Keep in mind that this is for August, okay? It's being recorded in July. A lot of you will watch it in July, but this is intended for the month of August. We still get people that comment underneath, oh, this won't happen to me. Well, it hasn't happened yet. So let's just see what happens. What do we have for the month of August for Leo? Happy birthday. What do we have for Leo for August? One card, please. Ooh, new beginning. So this is the fool. The fool is a new beginning. It's starting from scratch, taking a risk, acting on impulse, stepping into new territory, starting a new journey. So this is a new beginning for you. So August marks a new beginning. It's, it's, it's your solar return anyway, so it makes complete sense. Now starting at zero is starting at zero. It's not starting at one. So this is literally a brand new beginning for you. It's the beginning of a new journey, okay? Now, it's like the world is below your feet, so you are on top of the world. This is a month where you're going to be on top of the world. Oh! August, a big month for you. Big, 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 big month, Okay. So, and interesting. I mean, August is your new beginning, so chalk it up to that. What else do we have for Leo? A couple more, please. That's good. Carriage. A journey. Interesting, because I said you're going to be taking a journey. You may be traveling. Some of you may be moving. This is new territory, okay? Um, taking a risk, moving forward with blind faith. It's very exciting, okay? This is a very exciting new beginning for you. Carriage, a journey, either physical or mental. So it could be a mental journey. Man, ooh, dealings or relationship with a man. Ooh, we also have a younger woman here. So there's a younger woman involved. It's not you. Okay, so don't think it's you. This is somebody around you. Dealings or relationship with a younger woman. So we have a man and a woman here. This is not you. Okay, this is somebody else. Um, there's somebody who's going to be taking a journey. Interesting. Your life is going to be affected by a younger woman, by the looks of things. Maybe you have a man that is dealing with a younger woman. Hmm. Maybe you have a man that is traveling to you, or you're going to be traveling with a man. Maybe you're starting a new journey, and there's a man involved. But typically, this is a new beginning for you. That's leaving the baggage behind. It's leaving the past behind. This is a whole new chapter. This is the first card in the deck. Okay, one phase of your life is over. You're starting a new phase. The unknown card. Interesting. So it's in your hands. The future is in your hands. The future is up to you. Okay, you. it's what you see. The future is what you see. Not what anybody else sees. It's what you see. Okay, interesting. So the future is yet to be known because you have to take that step. You, it's what you see. It's what you want. It's like you can't... This is the future is, is yet to be told. It's yet to be told because free will plays a part. Your free will plays a part. Are you going to step into your new life or are you going to stay holding on to baggage? Because the fool leaves all the baggage behind. Okay, I'm leaving that behind. not taking anything with me on this new journey. Okay? So, but the future is in your hands. Okay, so the... Well, interesting. Now, this is the Three of Swords reverse is leaving the past hurts behind. So interesting. It's just falling right into uh, context, okay? Everything is falling right into place. And that is what's going to happen. Every word that comes out of my mouth is part of this reading. So everything is going to fall right into place. It's, it's like one step just leads to the other. 
okay and it's fantastic you are going to be leaving something behind because this is leaving the past hurts behind this is things getting better on the path to recovery this is healing releasing pain okay the chariot this is taking a journey this is a journey this is determined mental strength a transformation moving forward towards victory M mastering your emotions having a lot of self -dis discipline being in control uh, going someplace you're going someplace you're really really uh headed towards success here you're in in the chariot is leaving something behind you're leaving something behind. Some of you are actually moving. If you're not moving, you're traveling. You're traveling or you're going someplace. This is really, really, really good. It is. Um, you're in control. You've you've got the reins. You you're 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 in the driver's seat this month. You're the boss, which is very clear. Ah, the devil reverse. Now you are severing ties with something that is unhealthy. This is taking back control. You are finding the discipline. You're mastering your emotions. You are going to, this is your month. This is your month of severing ties from an unhealthy situation. Um, this is severing ties, taking back control. You've been uh, controlled. You've been under somebody else's control, but this is taking back control. Now you're in control. You're no longer going to be a slave. You're not, you're not, you have a lot of discipline this month. You, you aren't letting temptations get the best of you. You are, you're the boss. Okay, you're the boss. There, it's like nothing can tempt you. You're in control. Ah, the hermit reversed. Now, the hermit reversed is you may be rejecting somebody because this is a rejection. Uh, this is uh, it's time to socialize. It's coming out of hiding. It's time to reconnect. You're moving. You're going someplace. You may be reconnecting with somebody, um, reconnecting with yourself even because this is very self. You're reconnecting. You've re-identifying. You're re-identifying yourself. You've been in some sort of hermit mode. Perhaps you're coming out of hermit mode. Page of Wands reversed. Now the Page of Wands reversed isn't so good. Okay, that's bad news. That is negative thinking. Uh, this is this is a self-image problem, victim mentality very pessimistic there could be some unwelcome news that is coming okay there could be this is unwelcome news it's not good news okay the page of wands reverse is not good news it's getting distracted now, but it's over here. It's over here, which is good because this is like the past to the future. You are moving in a better direction. You may have been uh, holding yourself back or something. This is bad. This is a setback. Making excuses. Procrastinating. This is procrastinating. There's been some sort of pain. But you're on the path to recovery and your things are going to change fast. I know I can see that they are. You're going to find the discipline and the willpower and the determination to change your destination. It's like there's a destination change here. We do have the Empress in reversed on the bottom. So this is an unhealthy. We have somebody here that isn't healthy. Um, this is somebody who doesn't take very good care of their children, doesn't take care of themselves, doesn't know their value. Um is very selfish very needy you could be dealing or maybe it's you I don't know somebody may have been dealing with a very selfish individual um, very mean-spirited hmm. the Emperor the Emperor so the Emperor is the boss you are gonna be the boss this month 
you are you're going to be you're going to be in complete control i know that you are it's like you're the boss you're in control uh you're ready to fight you're ready for battle there is there is uh nobody that can take you down you've been in a negative mindset though because this is a negative mindset but this is regaining control again regaining control regaining control regaining control so you are regaining control of your emotions you there's it's like you are a warrior you're a warrior this month um leaving the past hurts behind Ah, this this is bad news. Procrastinating. This poor self-image. Um, a setback of some sort. Needing a new direction. You were in need of a new direction, but you you may have been making excuses or something like that. Be careful not to get a big head either because the page of wands in reverse can be... Um, somebody that is a show off. So don't, don't, just because you're in control and you're doing so good, beware of getting a big head. Okay, just saying. Okay, I'm just saying. I feel as, and then as for some of you, you know, there's something to do with a father or a masculine energy, and maybe it's this dark man, or it doesn't say dark man, but it says dealings or relationship with a man. This man has dark colored hair by the looks of things, doesn't have to be. But anyway, this is this, there's some sort of this is unknown, it's unknown what the outcome will be based on your actions, okay? Because this is definitely about actions. Beware, okay? Just have to tell you to beware, beware of your actions because. Uh, the Hermit Reverse can also be um, a need to retreat, a need for a retreat. There may be a need to retreat here, okay? Um, be careful of getting hurt as well because this is moving very fast. So make sure that you're being, be, be, don't move too fast just because, you know, uh, just be careful. I mean, the devil, re I'm going to go with all kinds of, of meanings to these cards. The devil reverse can be a disaster. Okay, it can be a disaster. Because somebody's moving too fast. I mean, I just have to tell you the truth, okay? It can be breaking free from something that is unhealthy. A codependency as well. We have many meanings to a card. I mean, now we have the page of cups on the bottom in reverse. This is an unrequited love situation. This is uh, shattered dreams, bubble burst, somebody that is obsessed with their image. That is, uh, this is a rejection and this is a rejection. So somebody could be getting rejected, but it uh, gives them back control. Maybe you're doing the rejecting. Maybe you're rejecting somebody, you know, maybe you're rejecting this man or this younger woman or something like that. Uh, the devil reverse, this could be an extreme, extremely unhealthy Okay, somebody could be going to extremes. Uh, this is anxiety and depression and things getting worse. But I feel like you're really taking back control. Maybe that's where you've been. Maybe you've been in a depressive state of mind and now you're starting to come out of it. This is a card of transformation. It is headed towards success after being in some sort of uh, disastrous situation. Okay? Um, you are definitely going to be going on a journey, going someplace, um, starting from scratch, starting over, but there's, pro it's probably going to be emotional, but I think you're going to be mastering your emotions. Now it's upright. You just saw that happen. So I do feel like you're going to be mastering your emotions. You're going to be receiving emotional support from somebody as well. There is somebody that has some sort of, that cares for you. This is somebody that cares for you. Um, they have feelings for you. They may have a crush on you. You may have a secret admirer. Somebody that has been hiding behind the scenes. They've been hiding their feelings. Maybe you've been hiding your feelings. This can go many ways. This is, this is coming out of hiding, expressing feelings. It, there could be a new crush here or somebody that is interested in you. This is, this is um, following your heart and trusting your gut. And that, and you are going to be needing to, to the, the future depends on you. That is the meaning of this card. The future depends on you. 
It depends on your willpower. It depends on depends on your ter determination. It depends on your strength to let go of the past hurts. Okay, somebody may be coming in very very fast that can help you to heal as well. Somebody that is at a distance, you may be uh, talking with somebody that is at a distance. There could be some sort of distance here. You may run into somebody at a retreat. Maybe you go to some sort of retreat. You meet somebody and, or it's a vacation or whatever it is. I know a lot of people aren't traveling right now, but there's still a lot of people that are. Anyhow, um, now this is good news. It's emotional support from somebody. But it's after leaving the hurts behind. And leaving the baggage behind after you sever ties because the future is in your hands okay the future it's the future is unknown that's that's why it's called the unknown card the future is unknown because you have to you have to choose you have to make a choice okay you have to make a choice do you want to keep uh, being slave to something that is unhealthy or do you want to be loved I mean that's the choice so Ooh, we have death on the bottom. So death is an ending that leads to a new beginning. And that's what I'm talking about here. You definitely have an ending. Okay, that leads to a new beginning. This is a profound change. Your life is about to change. There's separation and loss, which is the meaning of death, that leads to a new beginning. So you are about to have a major new beginning. You are about to embark on a whole new journey. But something that you have probably been uh, with this page of wands reverse, which I think is your energy because that would signify you to me. This something has you've been procrastinating. You've been procrastinating with letting this go. The future is in your hands. The future is unknown because you have to make a choice. You do. You do. You, we have journey all over in this reading. You are definitely, uh, and it could be a mental journey, mental or physical journey. Traveling, moving, moving away from a toxic, unhealthy situation. You could be meeting somebody new. Could be falling in love. There's there's some sort of welcome message of love here, whether it's emotional support or whatever. Somebody may have been hiding their feelings. You know, whoever is coming in. I mean, this emperor takes control. Is very very organized. Shows no weakness. You, who, you know, the future is in your hands. You have to take ownership. You have to take control. You have to be the boss of your own life. You have to master your emotions. And I think you, and the thing is, is I think you're going to master your emotions. Now, the hermit reverse can be a midlife crisis. You may be going through a midlife crisis or you went through a midlife crisis. But now you're 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 in the driver's seat and you're changing your direction in some way. Hmm. Ooh. Two of cups. Two of cups reverse. Now that is a separation. The Two of Cups reverse is separation from, it's like there's, there's no compatibility here. There's disharmony. There's an imbalance. There's a, a breakup. There's a breakup, a separation, a divorce, ending a partnership, losing a friendship. There's some sort of bullying. Uh, there's a disconnection. There's a disconnection because of codependency, toxic, unhealthy, uh, I wonder if there's, for some of you, there's there's somebody here that is, um, there may be some sort of addictions here. There could even be a sex addiction, okay, that causes a separation. 
there's some sort of addiction that causes a separation. Now this is a vehicle. So traveling, traveling, somebody's on the road, they're on the road. This is bad news. So there's some sort of bad news. I don't know what it is. This, whatever this news is, is it's going to help you to leave something behind that you have been procrastinating to let go. And I don't know what it is, but you do. This this could be a judge that makes a decision. This is making a decision and sticking to it. So this is whatever is happening. This is this this is the unknown card where the future is in your hands. You have to make a decision and stick to it. Stop going back and forth. Anyhow, um, August is your month to get in the driver's seat and start a new life. You are going to be starting a new life. You're leaving something behind that was very toxic to you. It was a toxic partnership, whether it was a friendship or a love romance or whatever. You're leaving it behind and you are headed towards something more emotionally happy. Okay? You are. You're headed towards happiness. Extreme happiness. There's an end of a relationship here. We saw the death, the tens, or we just said the ten of cups, which is the end. It's a separation and loss that leads to a new beginning. That's what we got here. Um, this has to do, it could have to do with a father. It could have to do with a husband. It may have to do with a boss. It could be somebody that is in a, a position of authority in your life. Whoever this, it could be a mother even. This person is in, is, is in a position of authority. They have been in control. They've had some sort of control over you. You're taking back your control. You're taking the control away from them. There's no more being controlled by this, whoever it is, person. Oh my freaking God. So that's the tower. So there's going to be a fated event. This is destruction, a life change, an explosion, you know, some sort of shock, a shocking uh, disruption. There could even be an accident that breaks you free, okay? I'm not trying to scare anybody, but you can feel free to look up the tower, okay? This is the universe shedding the light, showing you something. Uh, there's going to be a major disturbance, okay? There's, there is. It's like it comes in, it comes in all of a sudden, too. All of a sudden, there's, there's a, a major life change that allows you to break free from something that uh, isn't stable, isn't secure, isn't real, um, isn't built on a strong foundation. There's, there's, uh, it's, it's, it's going to crumble. It's going to, there's, it's like, it's, it's, it's crumbling now. It's falling apart right now. It's falling apart. Um, it is, it happens very, very, very fast, very, 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 very fast. Um, it's like all of a sudden, boom, it's, I mean, look at it, it's crumbling fast. It's like, it just, and it gets, it's, it's just done. It's just done. It's just washed away. It's just like, it's like this, uh, big wave comes in and, and wapes it out. Okay. It's just like, uh, Wow. Wow, wow. It's going to be a wow moment. It's probably going to be emotional as well. It's like, uh, at one time, this was beautiful. It was really, really beautiful, but now it's over. So there's going to, for some of you, there's going to be a change in residence. Okay, you're going to need to rebuild someplace else. Um, this is a major life change. Um, that's tried, somebody's been procrastinating, they've been trying to avoid it, they have, they've been trying, but you can't avoid it, the universe says you must, you must, this is false, it's a false sense of security, it's not serving you, you're, you're not finding your discipline to break free from it, we're going to help you with this, we're going to help you, there, it's, you know, um, I think it's going to be emotional, I do feel like it's going to be emotional, um, it's going to, it's going to, it's, 
it has to do with a vehicle whatever that means it, it has to do with a vehicle um, you didn't see it you didn't see it coming This is the universe coming in to break something out of your life that isn't stable. The universe is going to step in and they're going to cause a major disturbance in your life. Because uh, this is about love. Okay, It's about love. It's about, maybe it's because you deserve to be loved. This is gonna this is going to put you on that new path. It is going to break you free from this toxic partnership that you have been trying to keep upright. You've been trying to uh make it strong, right? You've been determined to uh stay there and you can't stay there. Ace of Cups reverse. Definitely going to be emotional. It is. So there's a, there's a major life change here that puts you on new ground. It does. This leads you to a new beginning. It, it is. It's a beautiful new beginning too. And I, I know that you don't see that, but it is. It is. A, I know that it is. This puts you on top of the world, okay? It does. This puts you on top of the world. This is this is like a breakdown, okay? You maybe maybe you're going through a breakdown or maybe you have an emotional breakdown, but you will find your strength. You will find your strength through whatever this is to overcome this life change. Your life is about to change. August is a huge month for you. It's a month, this is a card of transformation. It's a month of transformation. Somebody hasn't been honest with themselves emotionally. This is emotional dishonesty. Shutting down. I mean, this is shutting down emotions. You can't just ignore it. You can't ignore your emotions. They have to be released. I think there's going to be some tears that are shed because there's going to be a separation that you didn't see coming. Separation you didn't see coming. With somebody that... Uh, I don't know. Maybe there's some sort of addictions or there's there's some sort of control or something like that but anyhow Leo I mean don't 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 worry because you are about to you know you're gonna when this happens you know it might it might, it might be emotional for a minute but you are going to uh, be starting a, on a new phase okay this is this is a new lesson this is a new beginning okay look at this as a new beginning this this event whatever it is is going to uh, allow you to start over. You're going to be starting over. Probably in a new place. Whatever that means. Good luck.